Hello, and welcome back to Pokemon. Ah, it's been a while since we played, and, uh, you know, we're going to get some work done today. So, first off, we are going to see if we can buy Dratini. Because it's time. It's time to have Dratini. We will sell everything we need to to get him. Even our super potions, which would, which would be lame, but... You know, it is what it is. Okay. So. <clears throat> yeah, and then after that, I don't know, we can just, like, do something else. Maybe go get a Cubone, since we have the Sylph Scope now. Yep, yep, that would be awesome. We are going to see how much money we have first. 22,000. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. And we are going to sell a ton of shit. Mm -hmm. I don't know, what do we even sell? Super potions? Okay. I should really check how much we need to sell first, but I mean, we can always come back and buy with what we have after. Woo! Just like pull like 37 of those like little spray bottles out of my backpack. Do super potions, I promise. Hmm. Can we sell anything else? Great balls. We can sell some great balls, yep. Nah, we don't need to sell great balls. Nope. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see, bud. Oh, jeez. These stairs are just the devil sometimes. Okay. So we are going to go see if we have enough moolah. To buy a buddy. <clears throat> Dratini. I'm not sure what his name's gonna be yet. Probably something to do with being a dragon. I have no idea. We just gotta see what comes to mind at the moment. Okay. Welcome to Team Rocket Game Corner. Is that really what it just said? Okay, so we have five. How much was that? 10,000? 10, so we can buy one more, and we'll have 1,500 coins. No, yes, that is right. Okay. I hope we have enough. I feel like we don't, though. We exchange your coins for prizes. 2,800. We were not even close. Okay, we can probably buy it after we get the silver scope. So let us fly over there with Beardy. Yep, you're gonna fly, buddy. Oh shoot, where was it? This one? Yeah, it's that one. Yeah. And boy Beardy, dropping us off. Oh hey, how's it going? Pretty fun day at uh. The Pokemon Center? Yeah, you're healing a lot of people. A lot of people uh, fucking up their Pokemon today. Yeah? Okay, cool, cool. Well, have a good rest of your day. Thanks for healing mine. Peace. Oh, I have a really stuffy nose, so I apologize about that in advance. I'm just trying not to breathe out of it and just breathe out of my mouth so that I'm not sniffling the whole time. I also realized in the last couple of videos, I've been clicking the keyboard, like, obnoxiously. And... I am so sorry about that. I didn't realize it. I must have just been like getting aggressive and going to pound town on the computer. I don't know. It happens. Oh damn it! These these stairs can cause it. Actually, the stairs are evil. Ha! Dodged. Maybe we already fight you. Did we? Err. No, we didn't. We dodged it. So, I'm not exactly sure which Pokemon are the best for these. But, I mean, gas and fire, typically not a good combination. So, I mean, let's just test out if Inferno is going to kick ass. I mean, that was a super high-powered move anyway, so he probably would have died. But, well, I think it makes sense. Except I think we would probably all die, not just Ghastly. <clears throat> wow, I'm saved. She's got some moves. 
Okay, we don't want to talk to you anymore. Wow, we walk so slow in here. Be gone, malevolent spirit. I'm not a fucking spirit. How many times do I have to tell you that, girl? You only have one Pokemon. Weak. We want to level Charmander here. Charmeleon. Charizard. I don't even know. I think he's going to evolve soon, which is going to be awesome. Have a mother-loving Charizard? That's like my favorite moment every single time I play Pokemon. Because, you know, I always choose Charmander. It's got to be said every single time. I started one with a Bulbasaur once. I quit it. I started one with a Squirtle. I, I honestly, I quit it before I even left the town. I just can't stand Squirtle. I don't know what it is. Ki 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 qua. But I love Charmander. I think it's because of that episode of Pokemon where he's like sitting on the, on the stump and he's like in the rain and he's just like. I don't even know. It's just sad. I'm like, oh, little guy. Andy reminds me of the Digimon. I can't remember the name, but it's the orange one. Yeah. <laughs> Straight Ghastly. Wow, these fights take so long. Maybe I should turn the frames up. Except then you can't really read what they're saying. You just have to take my word for it. Is there something in that corner? Oh, be a Cubone. Be a Cubone. Oh my god, it's a Cubone. Holy shit. Okay. <sighs> There's a lot of pressure. I don't want to, like, hurt him too bad. Honestly, he's only a level 17. We gotta switch up Pokemon. What is not strong against ground? Electricity? What level? That's a high level. Hmm... I think we should just go with throwing Pokeballs. Or we'll try a Pokeball first, see if it... Oh, Great Ball, perfect. Because I don't want to kill him. Oh my gosh, that wasn't even close. Oh boy. <sighs> There's a lot of pressure. Online it said it was really rare to catch these guys too, so we cannot mess this up. Honestly, I'm thinking about like... Saving the emulator right here and then just reloading it, but oh, that was close. That was close. We're getting there. <sighs> Sorry, I keep breathing like that. I'm st stressing out. This is a stressful match. Okay, go for it. Come on, come on. Oh, not even. It appeared to be caught too. That's the worst part of it. <laughs> Oh, he's, like, strong against Charmeleon, and I'm not even, like... Well, I mean, he's not really strong. He's level 17, but, you know, his moves are... Whatever. Okay, if we get down to one Great Ball, I'm definitely... I might... Oh? <gasps> yes! We got Cubone! Oh, my God. That's amazing. Oh. It wears the skull of its dead mother on its head. When it becomes lonesome, it is said to cry loudly. The skull of its dead mother. Oh my god. It's badass. Just... Fucking A. Yeah, we're gonna nickname him. Oh my gosh, you know. It's a guy. And his name is going to be Bad... ass yeah I just, there's nothing badass is just well it has to sound like a name so how about bad asser no assy badassy no hmm putting too much thought into this bad bad yeah okay we're just doing badass we can rename him anyway now that we have fly rename him at any time you guys have a better idea for the name you just you let me know and if it's not just a terrible idea then we'll look into it <laughs> oh sorry just pounding that i'm trying to find an item oh fucking stairs i'm telling you okay what's up lady 
be cursed with you. Qua. How about, look at her eyes. Jeez, look at those pixels. That's nuts. <laughs> she is just shocked. Go Inferno. You got this, bud. You are going to evolve while we're here. And it's definitely... Look at that. That was not even a competition. Oh. He's 35 when he evolves? I don't know. It might be. It might also be 36. I think it's 36, honestly. Alright. We got you, Ghastly. Boom. Might as well just use the self-destruct. Because you didn't do crap. Okay, we're just talking smack now. This is going to be a big episode. I mean, we get Cubone. You know, we, we, we're going to get Charizard, probably. Um, we are probably going to get our Dratini. Like, everything is just coming together right now. I don't know what an Elixir does. Sounds like it would be good, though. I really wish we could run in this building. But, you know, you got to respect the Graves. <sighs> I would say we could catch Ghastly. I don't know. I mean, we might as well just use a ball on it. One ball. But you can't evolve it all the way unless you trade. And I don't know how to do that on an emulator. So it's just... See, that wasn't even close. What is that? Oh, great. Wow, that is so dark. That was intense. It just drives a nail into its forehead. Wow, some things about Pokemon I forgot about. <laughs> oh my god, we... Just kill it. Just This is a little bit overkill, but it works. I don't know how to heal him from a curse. I hope it doesn't affect him outside of battle, but we'll see. I mean, if it affected anyone, it would affect Inferno, seeing as I was always fucking getting poisoned anyway. Sorry. I just get heated about that. It's like every time. I mean, come on. Hoo hoo hoo, beat me not. Okay. Chandler Jody. Who do you think you are, woman? But, I mean, yeah. <laughs> Enough said. What are these people doing up here to get possessed anyway? I mean, it's just a bunch of, like, they look like they're in karate or something. Or maybe do they all put on the same clothes once they get possessed? Oh, they're channelers. So, th I don't know. I would be a little frightened if I walked into a graveyard and there's just a bunch of people trying to channel on channel ghosts. Makes sense they're possessed. Jeez, what does she say now? Oh, she's just trying to send them to a happy place, I guess. I don't know if that's a thing. Plus, I mean, all this fog. Think about how much fog they're pumping into this building. I mean, this is... It's not like there's open windows in this skyscraper, and even if it was, what? It's not foggy outside. It looked lovely outside when we were there. It's not like the weather just changes once it enters the building for 24 hours. <laughs> but anyway, I still love Pokemon. I just don't notice some of this stuff when I was a little chillin'. Or I didn't notice it. All right, Paula, where's the ghost? It was in your brain, and why haven't your eyes closed a little bit more since you were not possessed anymore? Dreaming my ass? You just attacked the shit out of me. Okay. Oh, what is that? Is that a save and heal spot? I think it is. Nothing over here. Okay. Yeah, we have only, only saw we only saw that one Q bone, so it's a good thing we got it, and we didn't even have to cheat. Oh, it's amazing. I mean, I wasn't going to cheat either way, wink, wink, off camera, but, <laughs> yeah. A repel would be nice. That being said, a repel would definitely be nice, because Inferno's like, what is that, like a millimeter? We need to fight some stronger Pokemon here. No, I'm not going to join you. Alright, Ruth. What's the name of my grandma? Uh, Ember. Yeah, we're definitely going to go with Ember. Boom. 
once we get him to level 36, we will switch him out. We'll start leveling up like Cubone and Dratini, which will be awesome. Maybe we'll get a, we'll get rid of Paraz. I mean, how often do you really need like a a Cut or whatever? Or we could just teach Cut to one of our other Pokemon, but I don't know. <laughs> Apparently having a Pokemon slave is the thing to do, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Because at some point you just have to have good Pokemon. Entered the purified and protected zone. Thane's Pokemon were fully healed. Oh, thanks. Come, child. I've purified this space. You can rest here. I would not lay down on this. I mean, that's kind of a cool drawing. I'll give you that. But, like, over in the corner of the room, like, ten feet away from me, there's this woman who's possessed. Like, what is she? Like, while you're sleeping. And you're like, oh, well, I'm in my comfortable little square. I don't think so. I would not be comfortable. I'd be like, you know what? I'll just wait until we leave the building. Maybe go stay at the Poké Center or, you know, some dude's house. I don't know. That's just me, though, personally. Huh? <laughs> what do you mean, huh? I regained my senses. Good job. I wonder if you can get trapped in here. If she, like, looks in this direction. Like, okay, if somebody's in the corner going, Urga, Urgf, I would not sleep on the floor. Next to graves, too? No. And plus, you have these ghosts literally everywhere. Hmm. Something to consider. <laughs> Nine... 50 p.m. where I am right now. Not bad. It's almost 10. I'm going to wake up early to go to work because I have a work meeting at 8 a.m. So that's awesome. Car's still broken, so I'll be riding the city bus. Good. I'm glad. Oh, my gosh. Do we have repels? Oh, a haunter. That, we, that would be cool to catch. Okay, hopefully we don't kill it in one hit with Ember. Okay, we killed it in one hit with Ember. Oh, well, give us a lot of experience then. Oh, we are so close. I can taste it. This battle. It's after this battle. Give me your all. That just sounds like she's singing like a romantic song or something. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Level 23? Inferno boy, you are about to turn into a badass. But not like Cubone, it's a different kind of badass. Oh, Nightshade, look at you. Yeah, that kind of hurt, like a little scratch. Good try. Good try, bud. But you're dead. You are dead, and we are about to evolve. Oh, I'm so ready for this. Look at those stats. Look at that max HP. Okay. Woo! So excited. Gasp. <laughs> what? Inferno's evolving? No way! Oh. Wow. Yeah, do it. You got this, bud. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. Sick. We have this huge dragon now. Congratulations. Your Inferno evolved into Charizard. Wing attack. Yeah, you can learn whatever you want, bud. Look at you. Yeah, we're going to delete a move. Come on. Oh, we... Uh, this is... Ooh, what's the attack damage? 60... We need that fire move. We need to have fire moves. We gotta get rid of the metal claw. That's just how it has to be. It's not even that strong of an attack, anyway. Look at those wings. Oh, amazing. Jeez. I wish there was an elevator. Seriously. Give me blood. Oh, we should switch out Pokemon. Now that he's such a tough... 
tough big dude. Imagine this little ghost getting out and then, boom, there's a huge ass dragon right in front of you doing a flamethrower. Yeah, be afraid. Yeah, let's see. Wow. <laughs> Just not even necessary whatsoever. Yes, we will change Pokemon. We are going to level up. So I'm thinking we're going to get rid of Testico. I'm sorry, Testico, but we got to switch out with Cubone and Para Paraz. Because, I mean, level 8, I don't know. Beauty still has another evolution in him. So, I mean, he's going to be good for a while. But, then again, we do have the wing attack now with Charmander, so we don't really... But fly, I mean... And we don't want to... Ooh... I mean, I mean, just look at this move right here. Turns into a blue ball. Confuse Ray. Misses. Fly. Boom. Like, that's just where it's at right there. But we also don't want to bog down Charizard with too many, like, bird moves. Okay, wing attack. Oh man, this place is so easy. I think we're just epic pros, that's what it is. Grown. Okay, X accuracy, nice. Key, 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 key. Key, 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 key. Key, key, that doesn't sound creepy to me. I don't know. It sounds more like, I mean, honestly, and I'm trying to say this the most socially correct way, it sounds like she just has, like, a little bit of a disability, honestly. Or, like, yeah, that's. I think that's the most correct way to say that. A little bit of a disability? I don't know. If it's not... You know, send me a message, <laughs> and I look forward to reading it, and I apologize in advance. Key, key. You're not, you just keep saying it? Okay. Amnesia, too. Doesn't know what's going on. Repeatedly says key over and over again. Oh my gosh, Ghastly, I'm so tired of looking at your face. Oh, I have to switch out. I'm going to run away. It's a great strategy. And we are going to switch you out, bud. Because, I'm going to be honest, I forgot to. Okay. So, the fact that you guys could hear my key clicks shows that I'm on a laptop as well. Yeah. Yep. I'm going to be getting a computer soonish. It's probably going to be... Um, in like two months, probably. I don't know. When I get student loans next semester, I'm going to buy a PC gaming computer because I want to play Stardew Valley, honestly. <laughs> and because then I can do like, you know, cooperatives with other people and I don't know, that kind of fun stuff. Something fell of what? Something fell out. Oh, like a spirit? Oh, weird. My hair didn't fall out. It, yeah, it was a spirit. Look, we haven't seen another Cubone since that first one. Damn, it was just meant to be. Honestly. Meant to be. I mean, this is basically as fast as running away, so we might as well we get the experience. Even though it's like very minimal experience. Rare candy. Okay, Ghastly. Go, Beardy. You got this, bud. Oh. 
Oh, come on. Yep, yeah, okay. We got the curse. Goodbye. Be gone, intruders. Oh, here's Marowak. Unveiled the ghost identity. So how does Marowak keep... I... Oh, I think this one's impossible to catch, honestly. Like, I've tried and tried and tried with this mofo. And you never catch it. Ground is strong against birds. You know what? We're going to switch out for uh, our foxy little lad. Yeah, you got this, bud. The newest member of our team. Oh, we have actually had him for a little... Have we had him for a while? I don't remember. We probably got him before we did Team Rocket's base. So, yeah, we've had him for a while, because that base can take a little while. I think we pounded it out, though. Wow, that is a strong attack. And again, too? Okay. I think we'll eventually evolve Cubone into our... Good old Marowak. We just have to enjoy him while he's cute, like a little puppy. I mean, he's still kind of cute when he's Marowak, but it's like an adult. Good. Now we have to go fight some... Like, Team Rocket, is it? I don't remember. Alright. Who wants a soda pop? Foxy does. We don't want to watch that, though. Okay. Yep, it's Team Rocket. What do you want? Why are you here? What do you... What the fuck do you think I want? I'm exploring. First of all. So, I came here to catch a Cubone, and then all these people are possessed. And now you guys are here, and I just went in your base, and like fought your master and kicked his ass so what are you why are you here honestly dick oh come on that's karma right there yeah we'll do a wing attack come on beardy you are so smart yep see got a boy i mean just that slick back hair makes me think he's got like a 4.0 in his I don't know engineering degree is that what he's going to school for he's just like taking the summer off to you know defeat the elite four with us we don't even have he's just like kind of like a bud honestly he has a beard it's pretty cool it's blonde so it kind of looks weird on his face but it is what it is oh fly was a bad move to use confused because then there's another chance that it might not work but we get a free miss. Oh, wow. He's so smart. Such a smart bird. Oh, So do you guys ever have those days where your neck just gets, like, really sore from sleeping on it wrong? And then you just can't, like, turn your head a certain direction all day? Because I've been having one of those days. And it is just the worst, honestly. Like, I crack my neck kind of a lot. It's kind of a bad thing, but it becomes like a habit. And then your neck gets sore. But today, I slept on it weird. Oh, finally snapped out of the confusion. And just like looking right. I don't know. I feel like I have my head at this like angle at all day, like in class. Looking at the professor just with this awkward angled head. I don't know. Oh, shit. This guy. This guy's pretty strong. Show him who's the superior bird, Beardy. Look at that. He's getting scared. Getting scared. That's right. My wings are sharper than yours. Says Beardy. Because he's badass. 915. Yeah, that's right. You give up. So we have to have like 30,000 after this if we want to go by the Dratini, I think. So we'll see. If we have enough, we'll go buy them. Otherwise, 
this is where we'll end the episode. Then he starts ranting about Team Rocket to be using Pokemon, so we're just talking it over as adults. Yeah, bullshit. He's, you probably trapped him up here because you guys are children, which is, I mean, honestly, that's what I expect, seeing as how they recruit eight-year-olds on the bridge. Seriously. That's what you get when you recruit young. You get, you just should pay more, pay better, and get higher level employees. They get some real professionals, not just the first noob that comes and applies. Come on, Team Rocket. Giovanni, you seem like you had your shit together, but you're just like, uh, bad business. Plus, don't always just go for Pokemon. I mean, well, actually, I mean, if I have a dragon, then it makes sense why you would need Pokemon, but, I mean, if you sneak up behind me and, you know, like, knock me out before I can pull a Pokeball out... You know, you have a pretty good chance. I'm literally 12 years old in this game. Oh, good move, Drowsy. I am so proud of you. But not really. Seriously, so much shit has happened in this episode. But it's good shit. Like, Charizard evolved. We got a Cubone. We sold, like, 80 Hyper Super Potions. <laughs> and we might be able to get it. Beauty might evolve? Look at this. I don't know what level he evolves. I think it's 32. But he might evolve. Probably not. Maybe. <laughs> you could evolve him with a rare candy. Whenever I do that, I feel like they might just have a weaker evolve. So I tend to try not to do that. But um, I don't know. All right, Team Rocket Grunt. We are going to wing attack you, little Zubat. Oh man, that Zubat must be terrified, except he doesn't know what's going on because he's using echolocation and Beardy is so fast. Yeah, we're definitely not going to evolve him right now if he has to get two more levels. We do have two rare candies though. Ah, oh, but if he has the. What does it really matter if he has a weak revolution? I don't know, probably not, to be honest. I mean, it might be like two skill points, but what if it's like one every single time? My CPU percentage, whatever that is, just went from 24.1 to negative 3,000. I don't know what that means, but it kind of freaks me out. Oh, that's why you're hiding them. Hiding that Rattata using the last one, huh? Because look at this. How'd that feel, bud? Did not feel good. Yeah. Um, so I keep getting this message that says encoding overloaded. But I don't think it really makes a difference in the videos. So if it does, leave a comment. And I apologize, but I guess I just... Well, uh, to be honest, it kind of is not the most fun thing watching back videos that you make and listening to your own voice I mean I do it to see every once in a while but I haven't in a while just because I I don't know I guess I'm getting used to it but it's weird hearing your own voice it's one of the weirdest things don't fight us rockets alright bud you're not getting away with this what with rescuing someone Hey, you came to save me? Thank you, but I came here of my own free will. I came to calm the spirit of Cubone's mother. Yeah, well, we did that too, you old lazy bones. I think Marowak's spirit has finally left us. I must thank you for your kind concern. Follow me to my home, Pokemon House. You named your house? Oh, moving on. At the foot of this tower. Yo. Thane, your Pokedex quest is one that requires strong dedication. Without deep love for Pokemon, your quest may fail. I'm not sure if this will help you, but I'd like you to have it. Thane received a Poke Flute from Mr. Fuji. Thane put the Poke Flute in the key items pocket. 
Upon hearing the Poke Flute, sleeping Pokemon will spring awake. Try using it on Pokemon that are sleeping obstacles. Do we need that much of a hint, bud? Has my Poke Flute helped you? Yeah, I bet you wish it has. Skin Flute, more like it. Perv. How do we check how much money we have? Is that in here? Coin case? No. I know. We go to a store. That'll do it. Oh, we can run? I feel like my legs are not broken anymore. It's amazing. Hi there. Bye. 17. Okay, we don't have enough. Do we? No, it's 10,000 for 500. We have like 1,500. So we could get another 500. Not enough. So... We're going to call it there. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed Pokemon. Uh, yeah. And if you did, leave a like and maybe subscribe, too, if you're feeling really generous. And I will see you.